it's panto time again. And as traditional, the Trafalgar Theatre Group will be entertaining the community. This year they tread the boards with its version of Robin Hood. The show is directed by Nadine Gonzalez, who steps out of the actor's limelight to take on the challenge. It's been nerve-wracking at times, but I think that's just me overthinking things at times. But on the whole, it's been good. It's been, yeah, I'm really glad I did it. Um, I've had a very supportive cast. I've, I've had a very good cast, but they've been supportive all the way. Um, I've had people take costumes of my hands, set design of my hands, so we've all pulled as a team. And it's been very good, yes. And you've taken on the story of Robin Hood for the first time, so what are you hoping to deliver here? It's like panto, every other panto is the same. No, we have, we take a traditional story and then there's a spin on it. And like in all pantos, you will find characters who aren't normally part of the Robin Hood um, a story. Um, we also have uh, Robin Hood tends to rob from the rich and give to the poor, but it doesn't sort of seem to work out in, in this one. <laughs> Things don't tend to work out like that. So there'll be plenty of fun, plenty of songs, um, plenty of dancing, lots of lights, lots of music, lots of entertainment, and most of all, lots of fun. Singing, dancing, and plenty of family fun are promised. But how does it all come together? We start rehearsing in September after auditions and then um, we rehearse with chorus specifically for singing and dancing on certain days, um, principals on certain days, um, set production. We've got somebody who, who's, you know, he's in charge of set production, costumes, etc, etc. And then slowly but surely it all comes together in Inces Hall. The pantomime is an annual January event. But have things changed over the years or is there a set formula when producing? Oh, things have definitely changed over the years, but that's just um, that's the way it is, no? Um, we tend to try and keep to um, some sort of a continuity, so we do tend to keep certain things in certain ways, because it's what works best. But of course, um, as acting itself develops, as actors develop, as actors come and go, as characters change, things do change, and we always tend to change for the better, so that's a good thing. Curtains up tonight, with performances running both this weekend and the next, to include matinee showings. Tickets are on sale at the Entes Hall box office in the evenings and can also be booked by calling 5401 6247. So does Gibraltar enjoy a good panto? Oh yes it does!